Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Nalib bin Chaudhraza and I would like to explain the introduction of flowing pipe. Pipes are all around us. Every time we turn the faucet, we expect water to come out. We expect there to be sufficient pressure to get the job done. Be it filling a glass of water in a timely manner or taking a nice shower. A lot of experimentation went behind the selection of pipe size used in various applications to ensure that comes out is acceptable. Other than that, the pipe flow experiment provides an experimental backbone or learning how to apply engineering equations to real-world situation where fluids flow. This experiment is relatively simple. Regardless of this fact, all the required personal protective equipment should be worn by all team members while in the lab. Some devices use 10 different manometer apparatus for measuring head loss along a pipe and stopwatch. The mercury used in the mercury manometer should be watched carefully to ensure that the mercury does not come out of the manometer. As with any hazardous, all the members working on or near this apparatus should be fully aware of what they are near. With this in mind, all team members should read and understand the material safety for mercury before entering the lab. That's all for me. Thank you.